Uh. Genesis Arc Mobile. Oh, Genesis Arc. No, I didn't mean it. Ricky, with the arse, I'd have opened it by force. Run. Oh. He's not dead. She's not dead. Pete! Hello, Jax. Ah. But you're dead! You died 20 years ago, Pete! From a different universe. Yeah, girl. It's a different dimension where- Oh, you can shut up. <laughs> you look old. You done. Yes, yeah, she does. But we love her. <laughs> you were left on your own. You didn't marry again, or- There was never anyone else. Oh. Did nothing with myself. Brought her up. Oh, here we go. In my world, oh. it worked. Blessed be the queen. Made me rich. I don't care about that. Oh, she did it. Not rich. Oh, she does care. No, she doesn't care. Not very. <laughs> Thing is, though, Jax, you, you're not my wife. Oh, damn. Oh, come here. Oh. oh. The Daleks is so much stronger. This is horrible. All units will converge on the Torchwood Tower. Oh, they're getting all the Cybermen to go against the Daleks. The Daleks are so much stronger. I, I wanted to know which was stronger. Answer! Exterminate! What the f is this? Why do they need to get outside? Time Lord signs. What Time Lord signs? Oh my gosh. Oh, Everybody run, run, get the hell out of here. Go! Uh, is that thing gonna blow up Genesis and open up all the Daleks? There's another Dalek inside. It's a prison ship. How many garlic? Millions. Ah! Oh, the Cybermen have no chance. Exterminate all life forms below. Terminate. Ah! This world's gonna crash and burn. There's nothing we can do. Oh. It's not just London. It's the whole world. But there's another world. Wow. Oh, I'm ready. Equipment right here. Thank you, Torchwood. We can't just leave. What about the Daleks and the Cybermen? Oh. But in between the two separate worlds, we've got the Void. That's where the Daleks were. Okay. Rebooted in three minutes. What is it? Void stuff. Ah. And the only one who hasn't been through the Void? Your mother. Ah. Cybermen, all of them. I just open the Void and reverse. Void stuff gets sucked back inside. Oh. The void, the dead space. Some people call it hell. <laughs> We've all got void stuff. Me too, because we went to that parallel world. Oh, she does too? That's why you've got to go. Repeat in two minutes. Pete's world. Hey, we should call it that. Pete's world. Oh. You'll be safe on that side. Where the hell's my tissue? I don't even know where I threw it. Great. Do you stay on this side? Well, you'll get pulled in. What? That's why I got these. To another world and then it gets sealed off. Oh. oh that's not gonna happen. Is this how she dies? She's gonna live with her whole family. 20 years without you, so button it. I'm not leaving her. I've had a life with you for 19 years. What? You plan it out there, he does it alone, Mum. But not anymore. Because now he's got me. Oh he's not doing that to me again. Oh, she went back. I've got Said every time I use one of these, it damages the whole world. Oh, I made my choice a long time ago, and I'm never gonna leave you. Rose, that's your mother. Resistance oh my god, this girl. Open access. Okay, she dead. You will not pass. What? <laughs> that's the lady from Torchwood. She's 
That's her. Press the red button. Rage active. X time, mama. You ready? So die. What did that one do? He escaped. Oh my god, it looks like a bunch of news clippers. Ooh. Rose. 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 would rather be with the doctor than her own family. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Music. Oh. Oh, so now she's in a different parallel universe. But at least you have your family. Oh, blessed be the queen. Oh my God, is that it? Last night I had a dream. Oh. I told mom and dad and Mickey. Anyone else would think I was mad. Oh. That night we packed up. Where are you going? Got into dad's old Jeep and off we went. Where are you going? Followed the voice. Okay. And this is a story of how I died. What? Oh, there's a doctor. There's one tiny little gap in the universe left. Just about to close. Oh. Bring up a sun just to say goodbye. Goodbye. I don't have a tissue. <laughs> oh, that's beautiful. Two universes would collapse. Sorry. Oh, I found a tissue. We're in Norway. Norway? About 50 miles out of Bergen. Norway. Hey, I'm Norway. Stranding. Dalek. Darling. Darling. This translates as bad wolf. Hey. Bad wolf. Wrapping up that bad wolf. There's five of us now. Mum, Dad, Mickey, and the baby. The baby? No. <laughs> it's Mum. She had a baby? Yeah, I'm, I'm back working in the shop. Oh. Tortured on this planet, so open for business. Rose Tyler, defender of the earth. She's in Torchwood or something? I don't know. So many oh. people died that day and you've gone missing. You're on the list of the dead. Oh, that's why. Living a life day after day. The one adventure I can never have. Oh. I'll see you again. <laughs> Most likely, no. What are you gonna do? <sighs> I love you. Oh, she said the L word. It's my last chance to say it. Rose Tyler. Oh. I surrender. I surrender. What the f what? is this? Huh? Where am I? What? What the hell is this place? <laughs> Who the hell is her? Bear with me. Actually, let me walk away. Well, well. So I definitely had to walk away because I was, I looked a hot mess. I couldn't breathe up my damn nose. Like, you guys, when you said that this show was going to make me cry, 
I just thought that like, okay, a few tears. Child, I was crying like literally somebody died that I knew. This episode was everything. It was life, liberty, and justice. Do y'all hear me when I say this? Life, liberty, and justice. This, this, this was a really good episode. The last two episodes, this was my favorite episode throughout this whole experience of going through Doctor Who. And just to see now the wrap up of Rose, look, I get a little bit emotional. I actually fell in love with that character so much. <clears throat> so much at the ending of this, sh at the ending. Why am I gonna cry again? <laughs> I told you, child, this was like a five minute break I took. Um, but I really did enjoy Rose as a character as we wrapped her up. Like, she, she completely changed and it was really good. Their connection together and saying goodbye, it was just, and he never got to say, I love you. So that was, to see him cry too, it like hit me. Um, I literally broke down. I broke the, I broke down. My cat is like hiding somewhere cause he's like, I don't know what's going on with you right now. You're emotionally unstable. And that's what some guy I was talking to, he was saying emotionally unstable. So if he's seeing this reaction, cause I know he's subscribed. If he's not subscribed, oh well. But he said I was emotionally unstable child. So I believe it now. This show was super good. I would love to hear you guys' comments down below about how you guys reacted at the end of this season two finale. This show, I like I said it before in one of my other reactions that I wasn't sure when I was watching the show if I was actually going to like fall in love with it. And I can't even explain to you how much I love Doctor Who. Not only do I love this show, the fans, just the fans, the people who, and I don't even know all the fans, honey. I just know the people who, who uh, comment on my videos. You guys are just freaking amazing. And just the knowledge and the love that you guys have. I've said it before in my other reactions as well, in almost all my reactions. I have been acting since child. I've been acting for my majority of my life. And nothing gets us more emotional than people who love our work and understand how much work we put into it. So I think this hits me on so many levels. One, I appreciate the actors, the writers, the script. I appreciate the show for being the longest running show like ever. Um, when I was going back and like reading how long this show has been around, I'm like, dang. So just that alone, and then the fandom that just brings it and just ties it up in a bow, and just, I just appreciate that, just everything. So, um, I'm assuming I'm not gonna see Mom anymore. Obviously, I'm not gonna see Mom, I'm not gonna see Jackie, I'm not gonna see, well, she is Mom. I'm not gonna see Mickey. I loved the fact that, you know, we had Rose and her father and this going back and forth with the father and now she gets to have her whole family. The only thing I have to say is what I don't understand is I would never, especially after her, this is the only thing I don't understand. She wanted her father so bad. She loves her mother. She loves Mickey. But she was going to leave that all, especially finally have that reunited to leave that all for the doctor. So that's the only thing that I'm like, in my head, I'm like, ooh, girl, like, I don't, I, you know, Rose had to go out and Rose character and something that doesn't make any sense. Um, comment down below if you guys disagree with that whole little bit where she literally was going to risk leaving her mother crying. I understand Mickey, but we, even in season one, I'm pretty sure it was season one, when we were introduced to her father, that he died. And she even risked things in that episode, the time, just everything she risked to just see and be with her father. To then just throw that all away when you finally got everything reunited was very, very off-putting for me. Um, but definitely comment down below how you guys felt about that particular scenario. 
also I loved Mickey being being back uh we wrapping up his storyline wrapping up Jackie's Jackie had another child honey um I love the guy who plays the father and I believe that they said Torchwood is now in their world now it seemed like Je Rose said she was working back at the shop but was she also working with Torchwood because she knows about alien life? Like, did I miss something? Overall, you guys already know I love the Cybermen and I love the Daleks. Now, I had a question in one of my other reactions. Who was stronger, the Daleks, the Daleks or the Cybermen? And a lot of people said, uh, I think a lot of people were saying that it was, they're both the same. But clearly in this episode, it shows the Daleks are much stronger than the Cybermen much stronger. Not one of them, there was only four of these, these things, and not one of them could destroy, not one, Dalek. So obviously the Daleks are much stronger than the Cybermen. They're much stronger than the humans. The only thing that could defeat the Daleks are Doctor Who. And what, as we see with the Cybermen, Cybermen can die multiple ways because the humans were killing them. So definitely the Daleks are number one, um, baddies and I'm sure we're gonna get more of them because they have stayed around as well as the Cybermen have stayed around all the way back since the beginning of time of Doctor Who so I'm sure that they're gonna continue going on and moving forward and I cannot wait to see them again and if they don't come back around I'll be really upset because I really love those two villains um what do I expect in season three Obviously, whoever this lady is with her wedding dress on, um, I do not know. Is she going to be the new companion? Um, if so, I actually really liked her. Her presence, like, amazing. But how the hell did she get there? Why is she wedding dress and what's going on? I'm assuming she might be the new companion or she's going to be dealing with... Is there a special comment down below, guys, about... There should be a special, I believe, in between this. Comment down below what the special's name is um, so I could watch that and give you guys the reaction that you guys need as well. Also, this is the point where I'm going to re-say, if you guys could please hit that join button and join my membership. I would love to build my members up and also to add me onto Discord. You can find that in the comment section down below. There's a link add me onto discord we can continue talking about doctor who and i also will be doing movie reactions it will be unedited it will be um i will be sharing my screen with different movies that i'm really interested in seeing that i've never seen before i'll go on camera and i'll be doing there so it'll be pretty much a reaction where i don't have to edit and i really get to see my show and i probably will be like unedited andres so i will be cursing screaming sipping on some wine um and i would love to be interacting with you guys also um if you do add me on the discord i'll let you know then if once i do movie reactions stuff like that just put yourselves on mute on your microphones because last time i did hear uh different things but we'll talk about that in discord um we'll talk about doctor who right now so i think i hit and touched everything on doctor who just comments um about the special that we're going to be going into we'll probably see that special later on during the week check out my um throwback thursdays add me on the discord join my membership and I think that's all the instructions I have for my outro. I think that's it, y'all. And with that being said, guys, if you've seen this reaction and you heard all of my directions to do, but you realize you weren't not even subscribed, hit the subscribe button. They're here, 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 here somewhere. Please like and share this content because it does wonders for this channel. And I'll see you all next time on Andres L. Rea.